Ricky, um, I know the gaffer had you in on uh, Christmas Eve. Was it important to just kind of put that to bed, what happened on Friday night and move on from it almost? Aye. Um, I think that was the plan anyway, but I think it was definitely needed. Um, like always, you know, when you make errors, you make mistakes and you've got to learn from them and um, as you say, put it to bed. So we've had a look at it. Um, listen, we're all professional and we all know that we should have done better and it should have been better, but um, I looked at it and see what we need to improve on and see what we're going to be needing for Wednesday. Is that the frustration as a squad? Because there's a lot of games that, you know, have maybe you know, got against you by a goal or, and obviously a couple of points dropped here and there as well. The, all the good work they're doing, you don't want to undermine that by just these wee moments in games? So. I've got to keep that in mind, but I think I, there comes a point where, you know, you need to put points on the board. Um, Everybody, you know, it's it's kind of you get frustrated because within ourselves, you know, there, we know there's a lot of good stuff, but it means nothing if you're not um, getting the results to, to match the performances. Um, listen, there's been performances that haven't been good enough as well, but I think in the most part we've been pleased with a lot of the stuff that we've been doing, and especially at home. It's majorly frustrating because you know, three or four games pop into my head straight away where you think, it's, you know, Friday included, where you think we should have took three points for that game. Um, we need to improve on that and, and even games away from home, you know, you've come away with even a point sometimes and you've dominated the game. Um, so, as I say, you know, it's another competitive league this year um, where if you don't get pick, start picking up the three points, you, you'll find yourself in a bad position. What is it? Is it a, a ruthlessness, a experience maybe in some parts, or is it being clinical? Is it, is it I, I think a bit of all, you know, it's easy to say that, but I think a wee bit of everything. I think um, we are a wee bit naive at times, um, everybody included, and then I, that ruthlessness thing, there's been games where you know, I've had you know, a barrel load of chances um, and came away either no scoring goals and no taking chances, or you know, we've took one or two of them and then we've conceded poor goals. So I think right across the pitch, we need to improve and, and it's, it's a wee fine, fine lines, you know, which is, as you say, it's back in the, there's only been one or two games where, you know, there's been a big deficit. It's always, even against, you know, the old firm, it's been one and two goals here and there. Um, but as I say, you know, it's, even if it's one goal, it's still zero points and we need to turn that around. Was it, uh, I understand, maybe a, a struggle to get back forth together as well for the last week or so with the, the, the fitness situation as well. Was that, does that contribute as well? Does that make it difficult going into games if the, you know, your Paul McGinn's obviously been rushed back and you have to play centre-half at a position as well? Aye, aye. I think, um, listen, Paul's, you know, bags of experience and, and he's played there before for Hibs, etc. But I think, um, you know, we've been, it's obviously it's there for everybody to see, the, the injuries we've picked up, especially the major injuries. It's, uh, you look at you know Nathan McGinley's been out for a prolonged period. Jake Carroll, you know we've, we've picked up injuries, um, Bevis and Saul most recently. So it's you know it's when it's in one position of the pitch, then it starts to affect you. But listen, we've, as I say, we've got still experience and we've got plenty of numbers. Um, you know, we've, it's probably fair to say that we've had a, a kind of bad run in terms of injuries, but I think we've, you know we've still got plenty of quality to pick for. And, as I say, the, this, this stuff's been really good uh, in most parts. So we know we've got the quality to go and pick up points, but we need to start doing it. Yeah, I have that belief you can, you know, with the way you played most part of the season, that you can go to high books and cause them problems and get something out of this game. I definitely, I think, um, as I say, I think against, you know, pretty much everybody, uh, we've gave a, a good account of ourselves and it's been fine margins. So um, I think it's going to be really difficult. Um, they've also the new managers come in and um, you know they're, they're on a good run. So, um, but as I say, you know we need to have that belief that we can go and compete with anybody in the league. It's a competitive league that we, you need to be up for every single game, and, and Wednesday will be no different.